Good morning, dear friend. Good morning. Look at your shirt. Did you just make a remark that the buttons are on the wrong side? I think they are, but now I'm not sure. Not sure of anything, really, these days. <laughs> yeah, they are. You look so good. I have to take some photos of you. Um, so you're heading into town, mm -hmm. getting a coffee for yourself. Yep. You're getting green juice for me. Yep. Hopefully better than the other one. Hopefully there's no celery in it. Um, what are you uh, drinking? No, wait, I said that already. What are you eating? I'm not sure. Maybe like a um, you know, pastry of some sort. Pastry, and I've requested porridge yep. because yesterday's porridge was so phenomenal. Yep. But I will also accept oats and I will also accept nothing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and then when you come back, hopefully I'll finish editing the vlog that I'm about to upload and then we shall go adventure. Yes. Guess who's back, 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 back again, again, again. Grace is back, 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 my dear friend. <laughs> Hello, little Gracie in my net. Guess who's back for a brand new pet? I'm back here because my other one died. I didn't know because my mum lied. Does Khajiit have wares? For um, oh, I do not have coin. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Drink options, so you've got a green drink. <gasps> Yummy! And a celery drink. Ah, thank you. I have no idea what to expect, but... Juicy aisle apple and kiwi. Yum! And then, no celery. No celery. So, okay, I think I made a poor choice in my choice. Oh. Oh, that looks incredible. Ooh! <gasps> Yummy! Fruity! <gasps> There's banana, yay! I've got a croissant, so I don't know how much to fit it in here. Oh compact i can't believe i only just thought of this but now it makes me think royal git it's a real royal git well dear friends uh you know how i said good morning good afternoon uh i spent the entire morning editing the video that i just uploaded and poor grace very afternoon <laughs> poor grace had to take herself into richmond and um then she came back and i was like i'll be done soon didn't realize how much footage i'd filmed um Anyway, it's two o'clock, <laughs> so we're now going to go get a start on our day, and there's a zoo that I really want to go to, and a cheese place I want to go to, um, and uh, look at me, I'm brushing my teeth. I remembered. Do you remember the reason you brush them? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's raining outside, and it's quite cold. Uh, I'm going to unbox the last parcel and hope that there's something in it that I can... No, you know what? No. No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pull the thing out of... You know I said there was a coat when I reached into this bag and I was feeling around and I was like, that is a coat. Okay, let's pull this out. Um, uh, okay, it's... Ooh, oh, yes, I forgot about this. Look. This is very old. This is Martin Modell Sydney uh, vintage. Um, I don't know if it's fur. What does it say? No, hang on, here we go. It's um, uh, fur-like, uh, viscose. And then on here, um, some, uh, oh, there you go. Rayon and cotton uh, or something. Anyway, that's gonna be good to put over the top and De uh, Grace and I went thrifting yesterday and I have a whole bunch of things over here which I will show you in a dedicated this video. This was $5. I love singlets like this that have built-in booby support. They're very nice. Actually, I don't even need a bra. These things are amazing. Hi, ah, yes, and hello, native, my old friend. I have come to sponsor you again. <laughs> I swear that I will make a video and I will post it somewhere if I find motivation. One dollar, I'll have you know, I paid one dollar for this. Uh, one dollar redo, what a bargain. This is a real find. It's by the brand Calico. Um, I don't remember if I saw any, oh, here we go, here. We go. So it says it's viscose, nylon, silk, and elastane. Um, it's got an element of silk in it. That's great. I do love myself a bit of silk. E-Bantam chickens. 
But if I do this, nice. Oh, 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 oh. No, you still can't see. Hey. Hey. Oh, fuck me. What? Was it recording? Nope. <laughs> Unfortunately, you guys just missed out on a very funny segment that Grace and I thought we were filming, but it wasn't recording. We're basically. I was trying these on, and I was going to wear these with my outfit, and then Grace said, what if you wore the sneakers instead? And then she threw a shoe at me, and then I caught it. And Alex's laughed, life and flashed before her eyes, and she caught it. And then she threw the second one at me, and it, well, it didn't fly through the air quite in the same way that the first one did, and uh, it was rather terrifying. So, anyway, oh, fucking hell. Did you hit play? I hit play. Okay, here's the code. Do you... Do you like it? It's got pockets. I like it. You like it? Um, I also don't know if I should wear this today or not. Yes. Why there's not? No, there's no mirror. I can't see what I look like. I'm telling you, you look good. Well, that's all that matters. This place is so cute. I was last here with my mum in 2007. It's just so adorable. Look at this. Lovely little flowers. Magpies, <gasps> original East Magpies, nine hundred dollars. Oh, it's so beautiful. Look at this menu. Oh, this all sounds really yummy. All right. So you already had a coffee this morning, so you're going to have to tell us how that one compares. And now I'm so excited. I've had this place in my memory for years, uh, Richmond Treasure Trove, but oh. That doesn't look like they're open. Uh, this happened to me in Hawaii. No. Why? It's so misleading. It this says is, push. I push. This is literally like the why what why may a diner or whatever it was called that I was so excited to take Tiasha to What's and this place? and this place is called Connie. Okay. No, first job, I'm not going but mom we'll be stuck here for seven years yeah. yeah and that would be the happiest seven years of my life wow these are beautiful but also you're right i don't need it we don't need it <laughs> oh but this has birds on I it know, but it's postage stamps which is what i need for my postcards that i need to get yes grace is on a crusade to find postcards and i'm on a crusade to find pigeons so uh you said oh the car's running i just went to turn the car on and i was like why is it not <laughs> It's so quiet. Um, so your coffee's better than the one you had earlier this morning? Yeah, the one this morning looked fluffy and glorious, but this one just tastes better. So in other words, the, uh, the one this morning, the barista steamed the milk better, but in this one, they have a better extraction. Mm. Vintage on Bridge? Oh, look, look at this. This shop is called Vintage on Bridge and oh, it's open. Yeah. No, we keep going. <laughs> I, I told Grace she has to tell us what we're doing today because if you leave it up to me, I will not make the most efficient use of our um, two hours left until everything closes. <laughs> zoo do zoo, six kilometers. But oh, I go do, ahead. We don't go that way. The zoo is that way. Yeah, we do. Wait, so we we yep. go back? Yeah. So we're going to the zoo. Oh my! Look at all the sheep. We don't need to go to the zoo. There's sheep everywhere. <laughs> Look. Little babies. Look what we found. Little babies. No, please don't, don't, don't leave. Please, 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 please. Don't go, don't go. It's okay. It's all right. No, no, no. I want to take a photo of you. Please wait. Please stay there. No, no, so maybe no, no, your no. windscreen wipers are too intense right now. Run, virus, run. Oh my God, look at those schwangs. Where are the schwangs? Schwang babies. That's literally a, like a sea eagle. A 
seagull. A seagull. It, it's a seagull. That's what you're telling me right now. Where is it? Where did it go? That would be the most incredible photo. Where is he? Is he still swooping? I have zero idea. Fucking hell. <gasps> Well, on the recommendation of several locals, including Cassie, who we met last night, uh, we have to come to this place called New Norfolk. And we're here now. All we knew was you just have to go to New Norfolk. We don't know where. So uh, I saw a sign that said that they have, um, they have something for everyone. So I said, well, you know what? That, that sounds promising. There's probably going to be something here for us to look at. And obviously there's a there's a puddle for Grace to play in. I'm playing in my shoes. Ah, this right. is all my dirt. Really? Yeah. Wow. This is very, very cute. Good. How are you? Ten lined Japanese tea chests for $28 each. Now that that's really cool. Dan would so love that. Ah, oh, look at that piece of timber. Wow. $1,200. You could put like a piece of glass across this and use it as a table. That's amazing. Oh, it's so cute here. I was going to say this will do wonders for my self-esteem and it actually did. Look how long my legs are. Oh, that's so cute. That's adorable. Oh, it's so heavy. Wow, I actually really want that. This is so cute oh, I should get this that's so cute none of my pigeons will fit in it but it's adorable oh my god look $58 it is a duck cane $58 so cool wow that's amazing that's a side table and it's only $250. Things are so cheap here. Oh, Sam and Dan would love it in here. Look at this. Incredible pieces of timber. And they're so well priced. We couldn't dream of finding something like this in Sydney. Like there's just no way in the world. Look, that's only $45. If I had some way of getting this back to New South Wales, I would buy so many of them and I would put them in the aviary because Pigeons don't like to sit on perches, they like to sit on shelves. I would just make a whole bunch of shelves out of natural timber. I've, I've literally looked for things just like this. Uh, and back home, that would be like $500 for a piece like that. <sighs> I wonder if I could have them shipped over. This is so cool. Vintage sewing machine, it's beautiful. Holy shit. A ginger jar for $30. I have so many of these at home and I paid over 100 bucks for each of them. If I could get that home. Wow. This stuff is beautiful. Why is it so cheap? Well, if that oh, isn't... That's so cool. <laughs> what? I just realised what the games were like. Yeah. Like you have to yodel or you have to yeah. be able to possess a drink. Yeah, I was about to say, if that ain't the most Australian looking game, aside, aside from that, <laughs> that's not the most Australian game ever, I don't know what is. Wait, I take back everything I said. Boganology. <laughs> Grace, read this. Boganology. Mm. The original Bogan game. Excellent. The game for slackers. Wheel and steal your way to the top. <laughs> Look, it's got a, a dead set cracker. This game is special, packed with Aussie culture. Yous love it. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. We should buy this and play it. Oh, look, Drongo. <laughs> Smooth criminal, dips all your fucking dipstick. You mongrel. <laughs> Broke your mate's best servo sunnies. <laughs> I'm buying this. There's an absolutely no stopping. Wait. <laughs> Battle of the Bogans. <laughs> Make it a Bogan game night at your place. Bogan teams go head to head in the game that's packed with Bogan questions. 
from the Bogans that brought you Boganology. Wait, is Boganology 1 here? Because this is Boganology 2nd edition. I want the 1st edition. Ah, oh, look, a new way to name the pigeons. <laughs> yes. Yes, they came through. Boganology Booze Bus. Get your drinking boots on. No, Bogan is Australian. Yeah, true. No, but cheers, big ears. And lose your license and lose the game. Avoid the booze bus and keep on cheap ass shot glasses included. New game, same old bogans. No, no, they don't call them bogans in in England. They call them chat. What do they call them? There's a word. I'm getting them. It's it's so it's sorted. This is our fate this evening, Grace. Julie noted. Wait, wait, wait. Hang on, hang on. This is. Look at this. Look. What are you, what are you talking about, Grace? What do you mean I don't need it? Looks like a water bottle and hides a beer you'll, inside. You'll get that and then you'll need that. What's that? Blitzed. What's that? As in you drink too much and you get blitzed. Lol. <laughs> Shit post guaranteed to never deliver. Look, it's, it's Lucy. <laughs> a little goblin. That's what she always... What? Yeah. What? It's Lucy and Max. Oh, oh, there's two of them? Oh my god. <laughs> yes, it's Lucy, the goblin woman, sitting on Max. That's not offensive, by the way, because Lucy calls herself a little rat woman and a goblin all the time. This is so cute. They're boxes that look like books. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. <gasps> Wait, that's so cool. <laughs> it's amazing. Birdies. 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 I want to get this for my mother-in-law because she has schnauzers. It's a doorstop, but the, the schnauzer is pain. No, that's not a schnauzer, that's a, a Highland Terrier, I think. Oh my god, look at this telephone. Caitlin would love this. It's so cool. Caitlin would absolutely love that. Okay, these are so pretty. Oh, look at this. They're beautiful. Oh, so tempting. Oh, this one is for the um, Cool Mug Club. A Groot mug. The only thing that was able to pull me away from that place was Grace saying, all right, Alex, I'm dropping you like yeah. a sack of shit. I'm going into town. I was like, no, 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 wait, wait, I'll come with you. I'll stop looking. Well, 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 what do we have here? Would you look at that? It was meant to be. People, Cassie said to me, well, I know how much of a fan of thrift shopping you are, so you're going to have a great time in New Norfolk. And this looks like the biggest vinnies I have ever seen. Look, there's literally an ATM sticking out of it. They're like, you're going to spend a lot of money here, just so you know. <laughs> okay, let's see. Whoa, it's huge. Look how big it is. Me to the pilot of the plane. This is so funny. Tiasha would really like this. There's an entire other section out the back. I'm sorry. Um, much better. Oh my god. Gumboot pants. <gasps> I know that these things are supposed to be for fishing, but I gotta wear this for bird photography. Does it have any holes in it? I feel like they may be holes that have been patched. But hang on, wait, if that's actually patched properly, I could literally wade into the water and take photos of birds. This is game changing. Game changing. And also it's very Balenciaga. So it's 4.48 p.m. So they close in 12 minutes. So at least you know you're only gonna be waiting in the car for at most 20. <laughs> um, so Grace went in here. This is uh, 10 Lives Op Shop. Uh, I've been to one with Dan that was in a different uh, part of Tasmania and the reason I like this and it's inspired me um, they keep cats I don't see one at the moment they've probably taken him away but they keep cats and you can adopt them from the store and also all the money from the sales goes towards uh, this cat shelter so I was like oh, I should do that for pigeons I could open a thing like this I wouldn't call it 10 lives what's what's a pigeon pun I could call it can you guys have a think please and I can open a little store and I can fill it with stuff and then raise money for the birds. But let's see. There he is. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hello. 
Hello, cat face. Do you think I should buy this cat face? Hmm? Oh, do you, you think I should buy it? Yeah, okay. All right, no, I'll, I will buy it. Oh, look, here comes Grace. She's like, is that a cat? Is that a fucking cat? Are you doing what you wanted? Has it been 12 minutes? I don't know. I just turned around when I heard a noise and was like, Cat. Hi, <laughs> little baby. He's for adoption. No, not I wouldn't take him, but you could. You shove him in your bag. We can't have two boys in the house. He's like, come sit in the window with me. I will. <laughs> I told you that this is. I told you, the the cat themed op shop. I could open an op shop like this with a cage like this full of pigeons. Isn't he cute? A little tail. <laughs> you said he's watching a sparrow. Oh, I used to. Yeah, look at that. So there's literally a text message on my phone from you saying there's another op shop. It's meh. I didn't know. You didn't look close. Didn't look close enough. Goodbye, handsome boy. I hope you get adopted soon. This is a very handsome cat. I don't actually know what the gender is, but it doesn't matter because it's got a beautiful soul. And uh, this is New Norfolk. So if you come to New Norfolk, I believe you can adopt this cat. That girl that's just locked us out. She's like, must lock door before they come back here. Yeah. Well, we're just going for a drive now around the area because it's just incredibly beautiful and very, very scenic. And we're also hoping to find a restaurant or some place where we can eat and pee, but there doesn't seem to be a soul in this place. <laughs> there's just beautiful trees and nothing else. So there's this saying, I don't know if it's only used in Australia or what, but it's when someone's complaining, people say, build a bridge and get over it. But in this case, it's build a bridge and get under it. out the strangest thing. The birds are in fact in the trees, not in the water. Is on there? Yeah. In the wire. In the wire? Yeah. A little, is it a ram? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh cute. Oh, it's Oh, 
Look at this. I did it. Nice new lens. <laughs> we we may have had a, a mild panic <laughs> with thinking there was a person in our car. Oh, yeah, I was like, who was reclining in our car? <laughs> it's a bogan. They've come to play the game. Oh, Alex, you can see that garden. Huh? You can see that garden. Ah, well, good thing I've got a paparazzi lens. <laughs> wow. I was going to take the big lens off, but... Okay, what creatures can we see? Oh, whoa, sheep. Oh, that's so steep. Holy shit. Wait, so <laughs> steep with the sheep? Look at this. I was like, oh, yes, what a beautiful view. And then I got to here and I was like, where did the ground go? It just drops vertically off. Wow. Look at that. Yes. The sheep sound like they're saying, bird. Bird. Bird! We were driving and suddenly, out of nowhere, just picture this, you're driving, having a conversation. Sorry, let's just fast forward. Oh, what's out on the hillside? Yeah. Wow. Oh my God, cows too. I don't know what you said to them, but they took it as a threat. Yeah. They were literally right here. I swear, all the like nature's right like, she's coming! It's because the camera lens is white. <laughs> <laughs> they can see it from a mile away. But the cows can't, so it's okay. Okay. <sighs> Last time I was in Tasmania, I said I wanted a photo of a swan and I didn't get one. And I said I'm not leaving this damn floating rock until I find some. And there's a million of them. I reckon we can get closer to the water. Let's find... I was like, bird or rabbit? Bird. Um, let's, let's find a little road that will take us right down to the water's edge. Okay. Because the sun's getting real low. Yeah. Oh yeah, it is a rabbit, you're right. Is it? Yeah, it's definitely a rabbit. It's like hopping. Where? On the ground, near the fence, near the gate. How? Do you have like 100 out of 20 it's, vision? It's, uh, it's maybe like two meters to the left of that, that pole. It's getting closer to the pole. It's about a meter to the left of the pole. It's running past the pole. How, your eyesight must be Oh, oh my god, yeah. I see. There are two. I don't see it with my eyes, but I see it with my camera. <laughs> I don't reckon you'll see it now. There were two of them, but they ran into whatever that grassy shit is. Mm. All right, so this is called Riverside Drive. Uh, we are indeed closer to the river, but I can't walk through all of that grass there on the left. So um, I'm hoping that over this hill <laughs> is somewhere that is actually on the riverside. Because you can't really advertise it as Riverside Drive if Ooh. it's really just river side grass <laughs> no here we go here we go any any swans though mm. here we go how far there's oh, this oh pretty flowers oh beautiful flowers 
we'll come back to those. I'll come back later. Ah, uh, someone else has the same idea as you. Ah, oh, fucker. Can't put... No, I hate it when there's other people around. Just fuck off. Oh, cool, we can walk out onto this thing. But there's no swans. Are you shitting me? There's literally not a single what fucking the swan. Look? There are some over there. Oh, we can walk. Oh. Oh, you can walk. We hate walking, but we'll do it for the burbs. Hopefully when we turn this corner here. Um, you know, no, not hopefully. Good vibes only. Exactly. There's going to be swans around this corner. Many. And I'm going to get a great photo. Yes. Yeah. I was. I wish there was a glorious sunset to go with the little picnic table. I mean, there are those three spicy geese over there. Where? There. Oh, you <laughs> she can't see the spicy goose. See and the two over there. And the two over there. No, and the two over there. there. There is, but they're not close enough. Well, you know what I want? I want to see a bird on a log. I want a oh, horse. God, this would be the best place for you to wear that boot I situation. I, I could just go walking down into that, but what scares me is when you can't see through the water. Mm. If I can't see into water, my chest gets tight and I can't mm. breathe and I start panicking. Like I start thinking something is going to kill me. Oh. oh it keeps getting further away. Stop. Don't you do it when you, you want to go, go to people. it. Let me take a photo of you. Oh, yeah, yes, many. Good vibes only. Good vibes only make this happen. Absolutely. Brought to you by Good Vibes Only. Yay. Yeah. I've lost Alex. I was just there taking photos and then I looked up. Where is she? In the meantime, we'll just film some burbs. Little babies. I'll be honest, it is kind of fresh right now. Beep, 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 beep. Okay, sorry, son. Didn't like that. I hear you. I receive you. Good vibes only. Maybe she's down here. Do, 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 do. Ooh. Go, Burb, go. Oh, thank God. Huh? Where the hell did you pop up from? Ah, a wild Alex appears. Did you not know where I was? I was like, I've lost her. <laughs> I turned around for once. Oh, more babies. Oh, my God. Hey, Alex. I see your bird on a log. <laughs> yes, I am the bird on the log that I wanted to photograph. Once felt as it was. Oh my god, don't fall. What's that? Uh, I, I, uh, I got you a bouquet of flowers, Grace. Mm. <laughs> Here you go. This is for you. Oh, for thank you. Friend. Beautiful. You know, interestingly enough, those yellow flowers that we drove past that we were like, wow, how cool are those flowers? Mm. They are literally the flowers of that tree, <gasps> of, of that succulent. 
That nice. those flowers are coming out of those succulents. I've never, I've, I have heaps of that succulent at home, but I've never seen it flower. Not cold enough. Oh, oh yep, it's hissing. Oh my god, so many babies. That one, these ones worked out quite well. Hmm. It's all right. Mopped bed. Saint Albi, marvelous bee, let's have some dinner. I'm so hungry and everything else is closed. <laughs> oh, that sounds so nice. That sounds amazing. That sounds ridiculously good. And I bet it's beautiful too. And I'm also going to get a pink princess. Because they both, oh, look. Oh, no, pink princess and a sherbet sour. And then a, what do you call it? Double fist? No, double cut. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Look at that. Thank you. Yeah. It's like, it's like fairy floss. Looks like Yum. That is um, not what I was expecting when I ordered a steak. <laughs> it's just an enormous chunk of meat on a plate. And the, the side dishes didn't come on the plate when the waiter comes over and says, how is everything guys? And you say, great, but you can't eat your steak because it's not nice at all. It tastes really bad. Hey guys, sorry, I'm so behind on my uploads. Where we were staying had terrible, terrible, terrible internet and I couldn't get anything to upload, but I'm in new accommodation now. So hopefully uh, I'll be able to get the last two days worth of videos, or is it three days? time blindness anyway hopefully i'll be able to get all of them to upload now so keep an eye out because there's going to be a bunch coming at you and actually i really liked this video so much that i think i might put this one on my main channel at some point and just call it like a tasmania road trip or something because it was just it was so wholesome okay bye love you Mwah.